Hey, hey! Hello everyone, John here, and welcome back to the Super Awesome Geek Show. Today, I am a super nephew birthday hero. Yes, wait till you see the story behind this. But, we got a Starcom F1400 Star Wolf with the box. I am blown away. Absolutely blown away. I... In every toy line that I collect, I love to at least get one example of the packaging if, if it's not too difficult to do. And oh my gosh, I found some guy in Europe who was selling his entire collection in the boxes. And I managed to snag just one of them off of him for a really good deal. And I'm blown away by this. He, he went above and beyond. This is so cool. But yes, we do have, so this is the European packaging. It's not the United States packaging, but that's okay. Who, who cares, right? It just shows you the same box art. It's just got more languages on it, you know? Starcom Power Deploy no, needs no batteries. It folds up and unfolds. Motorized change from transport mode to battle mode at the touch of a button. So cool. Four different languages, actually. And we get an action figure with it, with a little visor. And I think he has the visor. This will be the first complete action figure I have. Starcom Star Wing. Lieutenant James Derringer, Ed Kramer, Bob Rogers, and Red Baker are ready to go into battle. If you collect them all. With its lightning acceleration and rapid fire mega laser cannons, Lieutenant Tom Waldron's F-1400 Star Wolf is more than a match for anything the evil Shadow Force can throw against it. Part of Starcom's powerful air and space fleet called Star Wing. Dun, 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 dun. This is cool. I don't know why I sang that theme song, but this is cool. Motorized power deploy, flex wings, and nose cone unfold. Magna lock lifter carries other vehicles or cargo pods. Wing tips unfold. Spring action landing skids deploy. Spring action cockpit opens up. Magna lock magnetic action figure locks into metallic strips on the vehicle. Mega laser cannons move. Wow. This has so many play features. It is awesome. And if you go on this side, you can see what other things you can get. The Star Max Bomber, which we just got. Future video coming soon. The Battle Crane. Okay. And this is the Star Wolf, what we got. Yeah, yeah. Other Star Wing vehicles available separately. And the bottom of the packaging just has that Starcom thing there let's get this thing out of the box it, it is open it's not it's not like i'm opening this it's 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 it was it was already opened so uh we're gonna take a look at this thing hold on so i've got the instructions right here i've got the vehicle right here this is pretty cool the vehicle's folded up into its cargo mode so it can go inside other larger vehicles and be stored until needed Starcom F1400 instructions, the Star Wolf instructions, really cool. This is a great little vehicle. It's cool to have all this extra stuff with it. All right, here we go. Dun, dun, dun. Are you ready for this? Look at this. This is going to be cool. How do I activate this? Oh, there's a, is there a button back here? Okay, there's a button. There's a button in the engine part. I bet that's it. Ooh, oh, my finger was in the way. Hold on, hold on. We got to do that again. Let's see. If I hold on to it from this side, I guess, maybe. Ooh. And then you just like fold these wings out the rest of the way. And we have a little Starcom vehicle that flies around. And now, check this out. This This little thing here is flat. So that I just happen to have a cargo pod here. We can fly in, pick up the cargo pod, and fly away. Whoosh. And then check this out. I can fly in, cargo pod deploy. Uh, deploy. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right. I, I thought the landing gear would be powerful enough to sort of like let it go. Cause see, you, you click this button here and these little landing gear pop out. Did you see that? If you, if you didn't, we'll do it again. See, I thought maybe you could like use them to sort of unclick the, but the magnet's too powerful. It's too strong. So anyway, you're just going to do that and then you're going to do it by hand. <laughs> That's cool though, right? Isn't that cool though? That you can do that? I think it's cool. All right, here's the last little feature. You push this little button on the side and the cockpit opens up. And we can take out, uh, what's his name here? Who's the, who's this guy? Lieutenant Tom Waldron. He's Lieutenant Tom Waldron. Lieutenant Tom Waldron. And he's got this little visor on that can go up and down. These visors are what I'm missing on all my guys. They're, 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 you, you can't keep those. I'm surprised this guy kept it. That's so cool. But he magna locks to the top. He can stand on the top. There's a magnet up there. Perfect. It's not quite strong enough to lift everything in the pile. Maybe we can just lift the ship with him. Let's see. Yeah, we can. Ooh, he can lift a cargo pod too and take it. He's in a jetpack. Shh. I'm gonna leave it over here. Shh. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. These little guys are pretty neat. Their heads are on like a little ball joint here. They do move around and arms that go up and down. There's no elbow joints. Legs move and there's knee joints on them. Boom, 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 boom. And they all have magnets in their feet so that they can be awesome and stick to stuff. Even stick to the background. No? Hmm. Oh, well. <laughs> I guess that maybe this isn't real metal. I don't know. <laughs> this thing might not be real metal. Who knows? All right. And uh, yeah. Yeah, see, I'm already making it fall off. I'm, I'm, I'm wrecking my figure. I'm already going to lose my visor five minutes out of getting it out of the box. Let's put him back in his ship. Cool. I think these Starcom things are just awesome. Really neat little vehicles. <sighs> And then you can fold it up for action and get it into the cargo of some, some other thing. And then when you're ready, you just deploy the wings. By the way, this little cargo pod um, opens up. See? Not quite big enough to put the ship in though, but maybe something else later on the line goes in there. I don't know. I don't know. But pretty cool, right? It's neat that these little things like have all this, um, you know, max weight, 3,000 kilograms. So the nephew card, this is what's funny. So yeah, I got this off a guy in, in Europe and how funny he did have an amazing day to adam you cutie my favorite nephew happy birthday <laughs> um so this happens a lot my name is john adams okay but for some reason a lot of people take the adams part and think that's my first name adam so they that's why he's like to adam you know like a lot of people do that i get I even get phone calls to say, is Adam there? And I'm like, you mean John Adams? They're like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Lots of love from your puppo, Kowser and Sadia. Those are the ones who must have sold, who sold it to him. I know Kowser was his name, but that must be his wife or whoever. But I thought this was the funniest thing. Like, who puts this in for a thank you card and then actually, like, fills it out like you're... You know what I mean? I was like, and what he did is he had the instructions in here. 
so that it was flat and nice, you know what I mean? And, and, and it had a little bit of extra protection. And, uh, and then had this, and then he had this, like, in cardboard, you know? So, I guess he didn't want it just flopping around in the box while it was being shipped, but, and then thought this would be a neat, he must have had this lying around or something and just thought it was a neat little, have an amazing birthday that's out of this world. <laughs> <laughs> but I just thought that was hilarious because who does that? No one does that. You're crazy. What's wrong with you? <laughs> All right, cool. All right, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. I appreciate you checking this out with me. I'm John. This has been another Starcom video. Vintage Starcom from the 80s. 1986, right? Really cool to have, it, you know, one in the box. Or with the box, I guess I should say. So cool. And we will see the Star Wolf again. Because it does go on to other vehicles that come in the line. And when we do that bomber... You'll be seeing some really cool stuff with that bomber and this uh, Air Star Wolf. Nice. All right. Stay tuned. See you guys later. Have fun. Bye.